Hi guys, what I'm uh, doing today is Photoshop tutorial number two which is entitled how to take an average photograph and turn it into something awesome. So this is a photograph I want to be working with today and it's taking, taken from Viewpoint Car Park on the Downs on the Isle of Wight and I want to turn this photograph basically into something awesome and I'll show you how you can achieve that effect so let's go back to the original it's actually a lot easier than you think so what I want to do is I want to increase the contrast between the clouds and the sky basically so we'll go image adjustments brightness and contrast now if I increase the brightness it's just going to wash everything out. You can see the bench and some of the downs but it's still like highly underexposed as far as the uh, greenery goes. So with the opposite, if, if I want to increase the contrast between the sky and the clouds, let's turn the brightness down. And I don't want it too dark because I still want to see some texture on the clouds. I just want to turn it down enough to so it starts to look awesome and the next thing we do is we turn the contrast up you can see it's starting to look uh, quite brilliant already and the other thing you want to do is you want to increase the saturation of the image which will bring the colours out turn the saturation up you don't want to turn it up too much because it becomes unrealistic. I'm going to turn it up just enough so it brings out the colours but doesn't give you that effect where it looks like someone's gone over it with a paintbrush, a bright blue paintbrush. It's about there. And that's the basics of it. Then you can. Um, adjust the colours and things if you want to adjust the colour balance increase the reds a bit and uh, increase the blues not the blues, the yellows no, that's fine just turn up the reds and the mid-tones and the shadows maybe and the highlights turn up the blues no. give it a hint of yellow and that's it now the only other thing I did to, the, did to the photo obviously I spent more time on it was crop it so we go to the select tool Just crop it where we want crop the bench out of it image crop right mouse click deselect and there you are that's the uh, original image turned into something awesome you can see they're both the same photograph so now you can take your images that you made and rather than send them to the recycle bin you can make them look good anyway hope you enjoyed that folks that's my little video thanks very much for watching